What's up, everybody? For the Winitachi here, you know what it is, and we are going to be going over more content that came from BlizzCon of 2016, and today we are going to be going over Diablo. Not too much happened with Diablo, but we did get some cool brand new content that is going to be coming into Diablo 3, but we're going to be starting off with the Rise of the Necromancer pack revealed at BlizzCon 2016 trailer, and again, as you can already tell, we got a brand new class for the Diablo yes. 3 series. So without further ado, let's get to it. Our world. As always, man, I love these cinematics. That sustained us. I love Diablo. They, they always start off like this. Lost. With that artsy intro feel. We feared this day would come. When the land A necromancer. Like Lish King Part 2 over of here, so. Night can no longer save those in need. Oh, he's in the tombs. He's in the crypts of something over here. But I oh, he looks futuristic. Will. Oh, freaking Lich King shoulder guards over here. Wield the power With the Necromancer Scythe, cannot. this guy is it. This is cool. And a new this is really cool. Army of the dead shall rise at my He command. wields the power of the dead. The undead. Goddamn Lich King part two. He looks like the Lich King, kind of. Oh wow, this is going to be really cool. What a great class to add to the game of Diablo. Necromancer. New hero class coming in 2017, but they don't give us they don't give us a goddamn date. They don't give us a goddamn date, son. All right, so restoring the balance, Necromancer overview. The priests of Rothma or Necromancers, as outsiders call them, have long remained shrouded in mystery. Deep within the jungles of Kajistan, they train to preserve the delicate balance between the forces of life and death. Now Sanctuary has need of their unique power, and the priests of Rathma will answer. You're bound to have questions about the upcoming edition of Diablo 3 Reaper of Souls. While some of the details are still coming together, they haven't considered everything completed yet, but consider this your one-stop shop for all the initial lowdown on what to master of the undead. So there was a Q&A that went on. The basics, what is the Necromancer? The Necromancer will be your next fully playable class introducing Diablo 3 Reaper of Souls. As a master of the dark arts, you draw the magic from the power of death itself and command mighty armies of risen warriors. Oh, and you can make corpses explode. Sounds like a freaking death knight. There are definitely exploding corpses! Hooray! I, now I can see why a lot of people were kind of upset. Who will be able to play the Necromancer? They're still settling on the final details, but the Necromancer will be available as part of the Rise of the Necromancer pack set to release in 2017. Players will need both Diablo 3 and Reaper of Souls to access the content, or in the case of console, the Ultimate's Evil Edition on PlayStation 4 or Xbox One. What will we get as part of the Rise of the Necromancer pack? In addition to unlocking the Necromancer as a playable character, players will also receive an in-game pet, two additional character slots, two additional stash tabs on PC, a portrait frame, panel, banner, and banner center. That's it. There's no, it's just a class. You're basically playing for, okay. I'm not going to get into details on that. Sorry, everybody. When the Necromancer will be available, purchase in game sometime in 2017, they'll provide more details at a nearest release date. How much will the pack cost? They're not ready to announce the price just yet. They're not answering shit. Will the Necromancer be coming to all regions? The Necromancer will be coming to all regions and currently support Diablo 3 Reaper of Souls or Diablo 3 Ultimate Evil Edition. Details on accessing the new hero will be... God damn, answer something, son. Who is the Necromancer? Here we go. Is this the same Necromancer from Diablo 2 or Zul from Heroes of the Storm? No. And the Necromancer playable... Oh, it does look like Zul. The Necromancer playable characters will be two new Nephil Nephilim heroes, one male, one female. Where is the female Necromancer? The Necromancer is still in early development and they're hard at work into the class as a whole and the female model just isn't ready for them to share for us at this moment in time. How is the Necromancer different from the Witch Doctor? The Necromancer and Witch Doctor are quite different in both theme and play style. Witch Doctors draw their magic from the spiritual connection to the realm they call the Unformed Land. This more light-hearted take on supernatural powers allows them to command creepy crawly denizens of the jungle and summon mindless zombified pets. Necromancers can expect darker, more 
controlled gameplay, centered around the raw materials of life, blood and bone, grounded in a philosophical, pragmatic approach to life and death. They're more like a calculated conductor in the darkest arts. Deadly serious and practice, they are the experts of curses and reanimation, and their pets obey at every command. What sort of skills or abilities do we expect from the Necromancer? The Diablo 3 Necromancer is a reimagining of the classic Diablo 2 class. While not all the Diablo 2 classes uh, skills will be returning, uh, they drew a lot of inspiration from the previous version of the Necromancer and that have taken into Diablo 3 version of a direction they hope will love. In addition to the corpse explosion as shown, uh, they'll also uh, have a few more skills that um, we're going to be having in store. Will the Necromancer get set items and class specific legendaries? Yes, they are planning on a full set of legendaries and set items for the Necromancer including the class specific scythe in their main hand. Additional details to follow. The dead awaits your command! The Necromancer will be coming to Diablo 3 in 2017 and they're eager to share more details with us in the upcoming months or closer to the release date. So stay tuned for more. I just want to say thank you very much for tuning in to the updates that came from uh, BlizzCon of 2016 for the video game of Diablo 3. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Peace out, everybody.